you want to build your own Linktree clone under three minutes? Well, go ahead and stick around because I'm going to show you how you can make a personalized, stylish link hub utilizing just HTML and CSS. Let's go ahead and get started. Let's start with the basics, an empty web page that's about to get styled up. First, we need a simple HTML structure. So let's go ahead and add a container. Next, we'll add an image all inside the container. After the profile picture, add a username and description. After the description, add a container to encase all of the links. And inside that link container that we just created, we're going to put all of our links inside there. Now the magic all happens with CSS. Let's go ahead and add some styling to kind of center this on the page and really make it pop. Now that we have everything centered, let's go ahead and add that gradient. Things are looking really good. Let's move on and style the container. The first thing that we need to do is we're gonna center that text. Next, let's change the text color as well as the background color. Let's add some padding and border radius. Now let's do a width of 90%, but we don't wanna to go too big, so we're gonna limit it to 400 pixels. And then we'll apply a nice box shadow. Obviously that profile picture is out of control. Let's go ahead and try to contain it a little bit. We can add a width and height to it, 100 pixels each. That picture looks a little squished. Let's go ahead and add an object fit cover. Then make this profile picture a circle utilizing border radius and let's add a little bit of margin bottom. Your username and description are the stars here. Let's go ahead and style them up to make it look a little bit more professional and approachable. The username gets a little bit of a bold text and the description has a little softer tone with that supple color that we see here. Now let's get those links stacked on top of each other utilizing display flex and making sure the flex direction is column and putting a little bit of spacing in between with 10 pixels. Time to style the links themselves and feel free to modify the color, which will change your text color. And then you can change the background to however you need as well. The last part here is to handle the hover effect. So if you're hovering over each one of these, you can make your links pop. And there you have it. It's a fully functional Linktree clone that's easy to build, fully customizable, looks amazing. Just imagine sending this to your followers or potential clients. If you found this video helpful, make sure that you hit that like button as well as share this video with a friend who's learning to code. And don't forget to subscribe for more bite-sized coding tutorials. What should we build next? Let me know in the comments. See you next time.